Cześć, dzisiaj ze mną Sławko z Czarnogóry. Hi, nice to meet you. Ah, nice to meet you too. Thank you for having me. Uh, you had uh, your rehearsals. Uh, yeah. How do you feel about uh, that uh, the effect you can see in the stage? Yeah, I finished my second rehearsal, so I really feel ready for 9th of May in Sofai, first semi-final. I hardly wait to rock the stage. Mm -hmm. On the stage we can see like a lot of choreography of yours. Yeah. Uh, where did you get this inspiration to, to, to your um, moving dance moves? Yeah, in the first part all, all the verses are very because I was really deeply in choreography. And the beginning when you see everything I'm doing with my hands, it's from Indian dance theater katakali mm -hmm. and it's called like mudras and there symbolizes power and lots of love you know and when we're speaking about chorus it's like a jazz uh, a, a, a little bit funky uh, choreography so i really wanted to make all my because i decided to be alone on the stage and all to be focused on me i really wanted to make such a unique and very special performance and i really think and i'm very when i saw it on, in the viewing room i'm really satisfied with all of that do you feel more like dancer, singer, actor? What do you feel the most? Actor, actor who sings, actor who dance. Mm -hmm. And on the stage we can also see not only your voice and your staging, but also your body, <laughs> your very training body. Uh, what kind of um, workouts do you do to like getting this shape? Oh my God, uh, so many because um, for five years I have my personal trainer and I'm doing a lot of, you know, stretching, a lot of cardio because mm -hmm. it's very important besides doing all my muscles and everything, I have to do a lot of stretching and cardio because, you know, uh, s because of that my moves are so beautiful and everybody asking me about my dance moves uh, and it really t helps me a lot, you know, because doing three minutes live singing without <gasps> taking a breath and everything, that's really important thing it's very hard and okay I am a hard worker so uh, it pays me all this time that I've been body workout uh, workout thing and giving my body such a huge special treatment it really helps me a lot and do you have any special diet a vegetarian mm -hmm. I'm vegetarian and I am on organic food you know uh, only Sunday is my day for like unhealthy food like pizza but it's very important also to give that to your body and some kind you know for like cakes or chocolates or some kind of ice cream because i adore ice cream but it's only sunday like the only day that i can eat unhealthy food you said you're a vegetarian as well as our polish representative kasia mosh i adore her I adore her. She's amazing. She's so beautiful. And she has such unique energy and so beautiful. She's like a princess. Mm -hmm. And uh, on her video clip for a song Flashlight, she's like presenting naked. Uh, just only because uh, this um, helping, uh, yes. then showing the problem with the uh, uh, docks and chains. Do you also um, accept this kind of nudity on the artistic way? Of course. Uh, also, I, I honestly, I also wanted to be naked on the, on the stage, mm -hmm. but of course, for the propositions in every in Eurovision, because I really want to inspire people, you know, of course. I wanna, you know, be limited in a way that there is a lot of people who have healthy problems. Um, your your image is really con controversial in media. How much is that your uh, true Slavko Kale Kalezic style, and how much does it stage perf persona? Uh, that is really my uh, artistic, you know, staging. Mm -hmm. uh, my designer Marina Banovic from Montenegro made for me like over 35 costumes without Eurovision costume. Mm -hmm. And uh, in my private life, you know, I, I also like to be fashionista, but this is only made only for, you know, interviews and everything because I made, you know, my artistic concept. Mm -hmm. And I'm so glad that I made such a huge revolution in Eurovision 2017, you know. Uh, whatever happens, I, I will make, uh, you know, uh, huge huge you know mark on this uh, year's Eurovision mm -hmm. but do you read these negative comments what was the like the hardest comment you you read to be honest I really do not read that because uh, you know when you think logically in the way that I only imagine that people sitting in their room and you know just writing that, writing writing what does that mean uh, as much as they write I'm a bigger star <laughs> and who, who are they also to yes. judge? And who are they? I am here, you know, interviewing you, interviewing me. So, I, I, you know, you have to be strong in the way. And my self com confidence is really so powerful. And that's the only reason I'm here to inspire so many thousands of people. And it's happening. And I'm really grateful for that thing. And it's my mission of, of Eurovision 2017. Mm -hmm. And what your family think about your this person at this this, this oh stage? My God, my family, my mother and four sisters, my biggest support of 
ever in my life. They are so proud. They are so every day we are hearing them sending messages. Amazing. And the, what about our daddy or brothers? Do you have any? Uh, no, my my daddy passed away like six uh, years ago, and I have only four sisters. Mm -hmm. I'm unique male in my in my family. Mm -hmm. uh, did they also? I mean, siblings? Did they also do some artistic things, or you are the only no, one? I'm the only one artist in my family. Yes. So maybe you should inspire them to to do music as well. Uh, <laughs> I, I I inspire them a lot. Of you know, a lot. And what does your partner, if you have one, think about those those persona? I'm of single. Mm -hmm. I'm single. So maybe after Eurovision, what was the perfect person for you? Like visually, mentally, who is your ideal? Uh, uh, it depends, you know. Uh, uh, maybe f like for five years I'm alone. Mm -hmm. Yes. I, I, you know, I really fell in love with Slavk. So uh, finally I make love with Slavk on the stage. You know, when I'm lying down and my video, I, I danced on my lips and some kind of making love with myself. So you don't look for love now? No. And what about music? Music, I mean, a new album, you have one yeah. uh, already on your discography. Yeah. What about next? When can we expect the, the new, the second album of yours? Mm, I'm preparing some new stuff. So and after Eurovision, you will be able to hear it. I will release them, yeah. So we can wait and vote for Slavko. Hope you'll see you in final. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're